What's up guys, I am back with another video and today I am doing something completely different I have not done on my channel before. I am doing a mail day, two package mail day, but that's not what's different. What's different is what's in the mail day. Today I've got for you two CGC graded comics uh, that I've added to my beginning collection of comic books. I'm, I'm starting to buy what I would call some future inventory, potentially future investment comics for a store that me and my buddy Ray are going to be opening not for probably like another seven years or so, uh, a comic book collectible store uh, in our area. And so what I wanted to do is just start out uh, some co collecting some stuff and buying some stuff and um, hopefully uh, um, building together a little bit of an inventory for future sales. So let's go ahead and start out with the first box. Let's do this first one here. This is a modern comic uh, that is I bought legitimately because I really liked the cover. And so um, these are both eBay purchases. I've actually never bought in comics on eBay, so I guess we'll find out and see if I bought from good sellers or not. Just like buying trading cards or anything else you buy on eBay, you just hope you're buying from somebody who uh, is reputable, somebody who takes care of their product. And this one is very well packaged. It's actually in two different boxes. So here was the outside box, priority mailbox, and then there's another inner priority mailbox here that he's got. So obviously with these, with these graded slabs, you want to have somebody to take care of them so they don't come broken or cracked and uh, inside this box it's completely bubble wrapped so this person obviously knows what they're doing which is great love to see the care taken um, this wasn't a crazy expensive comic so um, you know that's not the issue but the issue is just you know just protecting what you purchase and and that's what trading cards too you know you've seen me before talk about how I protect cards when I um, sell stuff on eBay and how I ship them securely and all that kind of stuff so this is very very well uh, taken care of here and so let me go ahead and get this out it's oh it's even in a bag too so that's even better so it's in a bag already protecting the uh, protecting the uh, slab so here you go let's see if I can get it in the picture here this is a 9 CGC 9.8 uh, Venom number one from 2018 so yes it's a modern one uh, but I love the artwork and the cover on this thing I may have to take it out of the bag so you can see it better. I'll get some less glare on this. The uh, case looks really, really nice. Um, the surface of the case has got a little bit of scuff marks, but nothing too crazy. But uh, yeah, this is a really, really nice comic. If you can see the artwork, it's really, really beautiful. That that Venom standing up on top there, yelling into the night with the lightning and everything is really cool. So this is the number one from the first line of the new Venom comics. Um, and it's really, really nice. Really liked the look of this. That's the backside. Uh, really like the look of this. CGC 9.8 White Pages. The Donnie Cates or Cats story uh, is kind of what drew me to it. And uh, anyways, there you go. So that's the first one. And the second one is, I guess you would consider it a modern comic but it's from 1990 and so that's you know not that 1990 is a long time ago it makes me feel old if it is uh but um some people consider 1990 and and to now as modern um i guess you could you have to make a line somewhere so if that's where you make the line then i guess that's where you make the line but um let's go ahead and cut into this Let's see how this guy packaged. This came from New York. Everybody's like, don't buy anything from New York. It's going to come with the, the coronavirus. Well, it's called washing your hands, people, and being clean. You know what I mean? Anyways, so this is also very well packaged. And this book was more than double what I paid for this one. This one wasn't crazy expensive because, again, it's, 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 you know, it's only a couple years old. Uh, but the cover is really nice. So... This one was, uh, this one I definitely bought for a potential investment for the future. Just based on potential future projections of TV shows on Disney+. Plus. This is a, Mar uh, a Marvel comic book. And it is an X-Men comic book, actually. So, oh, the bag on this is really beat to heck. I'll get a new bag at some point for this. But this is... CGC 9.6. CGC 
the number on this looks faded a little bit too. That's kind of weird. Uh, yeah, I'm just looking at the case right now. Anyways, CGC 9.6 Uncanny X-Men 266. Let me see if I get this in here. 266, first full appearance of Gambit and Mystique appearance. So this is this is the first comic book where he makes his first full appearance. I don't know why that. I don't remember seeing that number being faded, so faded in the uh, picture. That's a little bit disappointing. Um, it really is, to be completely honest with you. I'll have to go back and look on eBay to see if that pit that in the picture that looked like that. But, anyways, regardless though, this is a really nice book. Uh, it is uh, off white to white pages, and that's the back side. But it's a really nice book. Um, for something like this, it is uh, August 1990, you know, considered, I guess you could consider it modern, but to me a 9.6 really wasn't that big of a deal compared to the 9.8, but I, I really like it. Um, and so with the future projections, potentially there's rumors of Gambit getting his own show on Disney Plus down the road, and that could make this thing go up. Gambit's, Gambit's first appearance, X-Men, have been going up quite a bit actually over the years, and they're starting to creep up, so I figured I was going to grab one before they got too expensive, but... Anyways, guys, there you go. That's my two-package mail day. Got the uh, Uncanny X-Men 9.6, uh, Uncanny X-Men 266, 9.6 grade, first appearance of Gambit, and then the 9.8 Venom number one from 2018. Just love the cover on this, and it wasn't a very expensive book, so I went ahead and grabbed it because I thought it was really nice. And the new, the new Venom line has been pretty popular, so that's another reason why I grabbed it. Anyways, there you go, guys. Thanks, as always, for watching. Be sure to hit the like, subscribe. Uh, le let me uh, know in the comments below what you think of this video and these comics and I will see you I'm actually gonna be live tonight so if you're watching this video tonight Friday uh, May 15th I will be live uh, later this evening if you want to uh, check out the live feed and uh, come hang out thanks as always guys catch you next time